our next topic is how to compare numbers. Bagaimana untuk banding nombor? Okay, now look at these two phrases. More than and less than. More than maksudnya lebih besar. Less than maksudnya lebih kecil. Let's look at this example one. Okay. There are two numbers here. Ada dua nombor di sini. Okay. Do you still remember how to read the first number? Yes. It's 504,320. Okay. The second one. 501,000. 971 Now, how to compare these two numbers? Bagaimana untuk bandingkan dua nombor ini? Okay, now we need to use a place value chart. Kita kena guna place value chart. Okay, so start from the right side. This is ones, place value of ones. After that, tens, hundreds, thousand, ten thousand, and hundred thousands. Okay. Now, we need to fill in the number, the digit of the numbers in the place value chart. Kita nak isikan dua nombor di atas ini ke dalam place value chart. Okay. Let's look at the first number. Nombor pertama. 504320. So we will fill in like this 504320. And then the second one, number 1. Okay. Now, how to compare? Bagaimana nak banding? We start from the place value of 100,000. Kita mula dari rumah 100,000. Okay. Mula banding dari rumah 100,000. Tengok kat depan sini. This one. 5, 5. Sama kan? 5, 5. Same. Right? So, we forward to the next place value, 10,000. 10,000. is 0 and 0. Still same. Masih sama. So, forward to the next one, 1,000. This is 4 and this is 1. Ini 4, ini 1. So, which is the bigger number? It's 4, right? So, now, this is the first number is bigger, lebih besar. Nombor yang atas ni, yang pertama ni adalah lebih besar. So, lebih besar apa tadi? More than. So, saya letak sini, more. And then, of course, this one will be less. Yang lebih kecil. Okay. So, tengok A, this one. Okay. 501971. Okay, 501971 kat mana? Here, yang bawah kan? Bawah ini less kan? So, this is less. Okay, apa nak isi kat sini? More than ke less than? Yes, it's less than. So, we write here is less than. 501,971 is less than 504,320. Okay, now B. 504,320. Okay. This one. Yang atas ni kan? Okay. So, this is more. More. Right? So, what should you fill in here? Yes, more than. 
is more than the big bursa. All right. Let's proceed to example two. This one. Okay. Now, without using the place value chart, we also can compare. Tanpa menggunakan place value chart, kita pun boleh banding. Macam mana nak banding? How to compare? Okay, first one. First one, let's check the numbers of digit. Semak dulu bilangan digit pada nombor itu. Okay, tengok nombor ini. Look at this number. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six digits in this number. Ada enam digit. And this one, one, two, three, four, five. There are only five digits here. So, of course, six digits will be bigger than the five digits number. So, this is more, right? So, we write here more than. Next one, example three. Okay. First one, we check the numbers of digit. Kira dulu bilangan digit. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six digits. Okay. How about this one? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six digit also. So, both also six digits number. So, now we have to start compare from the 100,000 place. Okay, this is 100,000 place. 8, 8. Same, is it? Okay, now, forward to the next place value. 2. 2. Still the same. Masih sama. Now, we go to the 1,000 place value of 1,000. 7. And this is 9. 7 and 9. 7 less or more? 7 less or more than 9? Less than. Okay? 7, 7 kurang daripada 9. So, this is less. Lebih kecil. Okay. So, now we write here less than. Next. We continue with ascending and descending order. Ascending, look at this letter A. Ascending, remember A, B, C, D. Means that menai, okay? Menai. And then D. D, C, B, A. Alright, means that Menurun. Okay, go down. Menurun. Now, look at example one. Arrange the numbers in ascending and descending orders. Hati-hati. Soalan ni suruh kita arrange. Arrange maksudnya susun. Susun dalam ascending and descending order. Dua-dua kena buat ya. Ascending menaik. From the smallest number to the biggest number. Okay. Dari nombor paling kecil kepada nombor paling besar. Descending menurun. Dari nombor yang paling besar ke paling kecil. Alright. Now, there are four numbers here. Ada empat nombor di sini. Now, we need to compare. We need to find out the smallest number first. Kita nak carikan nombor yang paling kecil dulu. Okay, start from, uh, we check the numbers of digit first. Kita kira dulu bilangan digit dalam nombor itu. Okay, ini 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 digit. Second number also 6 digit. 6 digit. 6 digits. Okay, now, all 6 digits. Now, we... Compare, we start to compare from the 100,000 place. Okay, the first one, 2, 2, 2, 2. Same. Now, 10,000. 8, 4, 8, 8. Now, can you see the smallest number here? It's 4, right? 
So, I write here. This is the smallest. Paling kecil. Saya tuliskan nombor satu. Now, we left three numbers. Kita tinggal tiga nombor lagi ya. Okay. Tadi dah compare. Zero, zero, zero. Tengok rumah thousand ya. Zero, zero, zero. Ini zero, ini zero, ini pun zero. Masih sama. Sekarang kita pergi ke tempat hundreds. One. Ini one. This one also one. Okay. Now pergi ke rumah tens. Place value tens. This is four. This is four. And this is two. Yang mana kecil sudah jumpa? Two, right? So, ini nombor dua. This is number two. Next one. Tinggal dua saja. So, one four two, one four four and one four two. Which is smaller? One four two, right? So, this is number three. And the last one, this one is the biggest. Nombor yang paling besar. So, bila sudah siap susun... Kita kena tulislah. Okay. Ascending, kecil ke besar. Smallest to the biggest. So, this is the smallest. Tuliskan kat sini. And then, comma. Second one, two, eight, zero, one, two, two. And the third one. 280142 and the biggest 280144 Okay, now come to the descending Descending dari paling besar ke paling kecil So, it's very easy Okay, terbalikkan saja Okay, so this one yang hujung ini akan jadi yang paling besar So, you have to write here first 280144 And then continue by this one, 280142. And then this one, 280122. And the last one, 244280. Okay. Look at example 2. Complete the possible values for the numbers of sequence. Tengok susunan nombor di bawah. Kita kena cari nombor yang mungkin untuk kurungan ini ya. Nombor yang mungkin. Maksudnya, uh, mungkin jawapan tu lebih daripada satu ya. Ada banyak jawapan yang boleh kita isi. Okay. Now, tengok dulu dia ascending ke descending dulu. Tengok A dulu. Okay. 600,105 and the last one 600,142 is increasing semakin meningkat kan nombor ni semakin banyak kan so ini adalah ascending order jadi apakah nombor yang mungkin di sini Okay. Kita boleh buat yang lebih besar. Nombor tu mesti lebih besar daripada 600132. Tetapi kecil daripada 600142. Okay. Kita boleh letak 600133. Boleh kan? Selain jawapan ini, kita juga boleh letak 600134. Ada lagi 600135. Sehinggalah sehinggalah 600141. Okey, mesti kecil daripada 142. So kita boleh isi nombor ni banyak pilihan di sini ya. Okey, ambil satu je isi kat sini. Okey. For B, untuk soalan B, tengok dulu ascending ke descending. 990, 979. Okay, semakin kurang kan? Okay, bila semakin kurang, okay, kita tengok sini. 
Ni ada banyak jawapan yang boleh letak. Maksudnya dia kurang nombor di sini mesti kurang daripada 979032. Okey, dan dia lebih besar daripada 979000. Okey, so jawapan yang mungkin 979031. Boleh 979030 Semakin berkurang ya And then Boleh juga 979029 Ok Sehinggalah Satu nombor yang Lebih besar daripada ini 979 Oh sorry, it's nine seven nine eight nine nine nine. Okay.